If you're in the market for a budget action camera, is the XT U S6 the one for you? Let's unbox it and then find out. Okay, here we have the XT U S6 action cam, 4K, 30 frames per second. Lots of product specifications here. Let's open it up and see what's in the box. All right, start with, we got our camera that's in this waterproof case here. Let's see if I can figure out how to get this open. There's the camera itself. Oh, we turned it on. Destructions. We don't need those. All right, yeah. Lots of accessories and doodads and mounting things. So a little disclaimer before we get into this video, XTU sent me this camera to review. I am not being paid for this review and all the opinions in this video are my own. With that out of the way, let's continue. Budget action cameras are a dime a dozen these days. And with the proliferation of inexpensive sensors and processors, Budget action cameras come and go from Amazon on a weekly basis. XTU has been around for a few years and they've been providing budget cameras, whether they're doorbell cameras or trail cameras or action cameras for a few years now. And the S6 is their latest budget camera on the market. So as you saw in the review, the camera does come with a number of accessories that you'll find with a lot of other action cameras. The camera does have true 4K video. It's not upscaled. We're going to talk about that a little bit more. It has a 170 degree field of view on the lens. The stabilization is okay. The software package on this is a little bit clunky. The video quality is good. So the microphone on this camera is pretty good, but I did find that it's susceptible to wind noise. It only comes with one battery, which probably explains its low price. It uses an older Sony IMX386 CMOS, which came in the original Google Pixel, which I happen to have right here. So you've got a CMOS that's been around since 2015, 2016, not really the latest uh, CMOS on the market. Additionally, it does feel like a budget camera. It's very plasticky, the, the buttons are very clicky, um, and like I said, the, the, the touchscreen interface and the software just really isn't the greatest. So like a lot of other budget manufacturers, the prices on the XTU S6 are all over the place. It retails for $219.99 on their website, but on Amazon, the full price is $139.99. With coupons and discounts, that this camera prices at around $100, wherever you're gonna buy it. And that's half the price of the Acaso Brave 8, which is arguably one of the best budget action cameras on the market right now. So if your budget is a little more flexible, you may want to look at something in the $200 range, but if budget is the biggest constraining issue on when you're buying a action camera and you are fine with having older technology in your action camera, then certainly the XTU S6 is going to make a good choice for you. I'd like to thank XTU for sending me this S6 to review. I'll be keeping it and using it, I have a, I ride an electric scooter and so having this on me while I'm riding kind of acts like a dash cam as if I was driving a car and it protects me if I'm uh, ever in an accident or anything like that. Thanks for watching. I appreciate everyone who watches the videos here and keeping with the randomness of this channel. Next time I'll be reviewing a cordless coffee grinder. So until then, talk to you later.